Hi, this is Dave from Studio City Drones Flight Academy. Today, I would like to talk to you a little bit about the Mavic 2 Enterprise and overall just the Mavic 2 in general as far as the flight modes. So, when we get a Mavic 2, we have a controller like this that allows us to be able to go ahead and put it in tripod mode, sport mode, and position hold. Now, for those of you who have flown the actual Inspires, Matrice, or even the old Phantoms, you're aware that there's also what's called Addy Mode, which is short for DJI for Attitude Mode, which is pseudo manual mode, meaning uh, that allows you to be able to have no position hold control latitude longitude or on a GPS system. Notice though it's absent on the Mavic 2. Now most people don't even aware of that but and or why that's important. One thing that reason why that's important is because from our experiences there is a GPS anomaly of some sort approximately one every 35 flights where you get up in the air, everything's normal for a little bit, and then you might fly out to where an environment where you get some high EMI, some wireless, or just excessive metal. And you know, you really, it's almost impossible sometimes to be able to tell that. So sometimes the aircraft will simply enough can throw you out of position hold and put you in addy mode and or where the aircraft just doesn't see in some situations can just go out of control and start flying away from you and you're not really sure what the ha what's happening so what we like doing is teaching at our flight academy is that when something happens we like putting the aircraft into addy mode now notice that is absent on these aircraft if you have a the mavic 2 pro there is a kind of a way of getting around that using an older version of assistant 2 that you can program tripod mode and put addy mode right here which is nice to have but if you don't have the Mavic 2 Pro it's not and you have a Mavic 2 zoom or a Mavic 2 enterprise zoom or dull it's not going to work so there is one get around to do that If you go into the menu settings and you go ahead, go into your obstacle avoidance settings and you turn off the downward position sensor system, that will put this aircraft into addy mode. Simple enough, you would go into the top menu setting uh, for obstacle avoidance to get to the shortcut, scroll down and turn it off. Most people don't even aware that, you know, addy mode is not really possible or designed to have that which is actually unfortunate but nevertheless it is a way to be able to get attitude mode on here and obviously it is an advanced feature because it requires some skill to be able to fly in addy mode okay so now we're going to be able to show you how to be able to add addy mode to the mavic 2 pro this is going to work only for the mavic 2 pro first thing you do is download the Assistant 2 version 1.1.2. Now that's a rather older version and this will not work on any other version. So if you plug in your Mavic 2 Pro to this Assistant 2, you'll see it pop up on your upper left hand corner like shown. The Assistant 2 will not even recognize any other type of aircraft for Mavic 2. Next, we're going to go ahead and hit Command Option I as we mouse over our Mavic 2 icon. As you can see now on the right hand screen, you see a bunch of other things on here. So now we're going to go look for local storage. Now local storage shows up here under File. We will see where it says debug zero. We're going to change that from a zero to a one. Next, we're going to hit debug enabled. We're going to change that from false to a true. 
So we're done with this portion. So we're going to hit the upper right hand corner where the X is to close it. Now we're going to go into the Assistant 2. Click on the Mavic Pro icon. And now you'll see on under the Assistant 2 a bunch of other things that you probably have never seen before. We're going to scroll down to Parameters. Over here where it says Index Filter, we're going to type in the word Mode. Now you can see we have three different modes. Mode 0, Mode 1, and Mode 2. And these are the statuses for each of your position hold sport mode and tripod mode we're now going to go ahead and focus on where it says mode zero and we're going to change 12 to number three and that's it now we can go back close all this out disconnect the aircraft from the computer hook up your remote controller to your mobile device Open up the Go 4, and now when you go under Go 4, you will see when you are in T mode, which is tripod mode, on your mode selection switch on your remote controller, you will now see that your mode switch is actually your mode, flight mode is now in attitude mode. Position hold and sport mode will act just like you normally would. Again, if you have any questions, please let me know. Thanks again. If you like this video and like to see more free videos in the future, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. And while you're at it, if you're interested in free lessons on how to fly drones, discounts on drone equipment, discounts on insurance, or access to our exclusive drone video library, check out our website, steelcityflightacademy.com.